Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. A cruise to nowhere now that the Mississippi River is reopened to maritime traffic and Carnival Valor is now docked. Carnival announced that the upcoming four-night cruise will be shortened to a three-nighter and will sail a rare cruise to nowhere operating without a port of call. Now, for reference, cruises to nowhere require special approval from the U.S. Customs and Border Protection and are only issued under extenuating circumstances. Guests have the option to cancel or will receive a prorated one-day refund and a generous $100 per stateroom credit. Meanwhile, Carnival Liberty, also sailing from New Orleans, is unaffected and is set to return as scheduled on Sunday. The cruise ending this morning originally was a five-night sailing turned to a six-night. And Royal Caribbean will add Cabo Rojo in the DR as a new destination starting October of this year. The Adventure of the Seas will be the very first royal ship to visit there on October 16th during an eight-night Southern Caribbean cruise. The Oasis of the Seas will also join in May of next year with other cruise lines like Holland America and MSC also planning visits throughout the year. The port, developed by the Dominican Port Authority, can accommodate multiple ships and welcomed its first ship ever this past January. And changes. The Sun Princess will debut several updates before its Caribbean season starts next month. Now, key changes to the ship include the new sanctuary collection with exclusive cabins and dining, relocations of popular restaurants like the Catch by Rudy and Crown Grill, also renaming the main dining rooms to Soleil and Eclipse. The very top deck, which was called Park 19 when the ship came out, will be rebranded as the Sky Deck Sports Court and Track. The ship debuts in Fort Lauderdale for the Caribbean on October 14th. And the photo of the week comes from Tommy Casabona, Carnival Horizon here in New York City. Beautiful day here. Thanks for sending this in, Tommy. You can send yours in. Doug at cruiseradio.net. All photos are subject to broadcast. And cruise line stocks were up on Thursday. Carnival Corporation up 2.3%, 16.92. Royal Caribbean up 2.1, 165.57. Norwegian up 1.8, 19.03. And Viking up 2.6%, 32.40. Lead on a story, let us know. Tips at cruiseradio.net. Have yourself a great weekend. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today.